if I were God, I'll do a reshuffle. Corrupt people, I'll make them with corrupt people. <laughs> thieves will be merged with thieves. So every I'll put everybody into a trance. And then by the time you wake up, <laughs> the person who is by your side is, is someone who suits you perfectly. <laughs> Guys, welcome again to another exciting episode on your favorite podcast, the FNF Catch Dialogues. Getting straight to the point, today we are going to discuss an interesting topic and yeah. we want each and every one like and then move straight to the comments and type your thoughts. Probably give us five points or three. Yeah, three, on, three works What, what do you me. think about this topic? All right, and please don't forget to subscribe. Yes. Yep. What do we have today? So the question for the day is, what would you do if you were God? Mm. <laughs> if I were God? Yeah, what would you do? Well, so the first thing I'll do, <laughs> the first thing I'll do, yeah. I'm a man, no doubt. But I think to help reduce a lot of things that are causing so much problems in this world today, yeah, I'll just make sure that Every man, when I say impotent, no, no man has feelings. You won't get an erection <laughs> until the day you get married. <laughs> no, 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 nobody gets an erection. So why, why just men? Why don't the women also? Oh. What, what have the same? What would women use their thing for? What, what would they use their thing for? Okay, women too have no feelings. Nobody will have feelings in this world until the day you are married. So if they don't have feelings, how don't you get attracted to you the get, opposite sex? You, you get that attraction, but no sexual feelings. You won't have the edge for sex. Really? You won't have the edge for sex. No nonsense <laughs> until you are married. Then, well, then in this case, I would make sure that you don't even have the genitals in the first place. <laughs> You don't have it when you how, get. How do you determine your sex then? How do you know whether you're male or a female? You would have the features so to show, the but you just have breasts, they'll have butts. Exactly. And the men. And the men, you you just have a straight body, hard body, can't be. <laughs> <laughs> like you get me. And then when you are married, yeah, yeah, then there will be a hub. I'll build just, a hub. You just explode. You just go uh. plug yourself into the hub and download your. <laughs> And depending on the Wi-Fi signal in your country, if that would determine if you're in Ghana sense. at this point in time, then your honeymoon will be crap. <laughs> Imagine going to download over Ghana that's so like. <laughs> okay, so what would you do? What I would do, yeah. What I would do is, hmm. I would give everyone two lives, mm -hmm. but there's a caveat. So, <laughs> your first life. Mm -hmm. Would last for, let me say, 25 years. Yeah. 25 years. Yeah. That's too short. And the 25 years, make all the mistakes you want. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Make all your life choices. Because I expect that at 25, you'd, you'd be reasonable. You'd be an adult. Not, not make, everyone is reasonable at 25. Well, God help them. But <laughs> if I were God mm -hmm. at 25 years, yeah. then I'll kill you. You will die. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> and then you'll come. Uh -huh. The war have a VR. We we'll <laughs> we'll sit down, assess live year. I'm telling you, we'll assess your 25 years. Mm -hmm. Point out all the things you've done wrong mm -hmm. and the things you've done right. Uh -huh. Yeah, then I'll resuscitate you. Go back. Uh -huh. Now in your second life, you have three attempts to make a mistake. <laughs> as soon as you exhaust those three attempts, I'm, I'm. Ah, yeah, yeah, yeah. I would die you. <laughs> as soon as you exhaust those three attempts, you're coming back to daddy. Yeah, Your life back. is done. End when you come discussion. back to daddy, you've come back to heaven. So. No, you are dead, like dead. Dead. Erased. Erased. Yeah, someone else goes to take your place. <laughs> Shit. So, no heaven and hell. Do you think? Yeah, then you, that person, you, you are going to hell. <laughs> <laughs> no, at least allow the person to continue sitting and eventually go to hell no no 
No. No nonsense. Don't no, continue no, no, your no, nonsense. No. Two lives <laughs> wasted. Go to hell straight up. Burn. You will burn. So yeah. with the with the current hardship, especially in Ghana and Africa, where all over everybody, the world, everybody is, to be fair. But you know, the particular situation is in Africa. Mm. Talking of corrupt leaders, if if you are corrupt as a leader in an African nation, you are heartless. You are heartless. Why do you, why do you say that? See, if you, that means you have no pity. See the way people are struggling, the level of poverty, and then the little resources we have. We claim that the whites have taken our, our resources, mm. right? Now, the little ones we have that we can transform and make people's lives better. Mm. You steal that money and go and give it to that person that you said is the cause of your current problems. You go and invest in their country. What sense does it make? So, if you were God. If I were God. Mm-hmm. I'll just, I, I want to make Africa anew. I'll, uh, I'll, I'll, bend, I'll, yes, bend. I'll, I'll just, I'll just bend down Africa, bend every and recreate people. So I'll just pick out if <laughs> I thought, one. yeah, you were good in the previous life, then I'll resurrect you. The rest, you, you stay in ashes. <laughs> As most of the leaders, they'll, they'll stay in ashes. Seriously. Yeah. I, I mean, I, I feel what you're talking about i mean it's, talking about yeah. the fact that the whole lot of resources but yet we still blame our colonial masters for our failures and inactions but at the end of the day that is that and i think on the same tangent if i was god mm-hmm. i mean if i were god i would make sure that resources and you know technological advancement and whatnot is evenly distributed yes one thing that breaks my heart mm-hmm. when I compare the UK to where we are from mm-hmm. is the gap yes. in health, health infrastructure. The yeah. gap. It looks like because, a see, journey that is nearly I, impossible I, I, I for think, us to I think that complete. here, if you die, mm-hmm. then it's really your time. Especially if you die in sometimes, hospital. Sometimes you can die because of no, because see, compare reasonable com- causes and compare you- the rate at which people die back home. Like th- on the wards, there are sometimes not. Do you even- know, I think I think the problem is actually um, lack of infrastructure to bring a good night di- diagnosis. Because if you can diagnose a problem, you don't know how to treat it. Exactly. Yes, there's limited research. There's limited investment into research, and then there's poor diagnosis people no, I, I are not given accurate diagnosis this really needs this, to be looked at yeah. because they're brilliant minds and that is why home. i said i said i'll i'll just bend everything down especially our leaders if not everybody every Look. corrupt leader I'll, I'll just have to just end your life there and we'll create new leaders because brilliant minds are in and africa we, all over the world but yeah. because of these the you tennis, know, limitations. Our I leaders think. are very brilliant. We've got very brilliant. The reason why, even myself, if I was back, I'll I'll destroy myself if I had a replica who is a human <laughs> and create because it's like being born in Africa, Ghana, and you see this sort of corruption. Once you become a leader, you are tempted to follow suit. There are so many people who were less corrupt or weren't corrupt before going into politics, and then you you metamorphose into a, a corrupt person so the mindset is corrupted from a baby uh, uh, m- i won't say my mom like mothers that they pay bribes for their kids to go to school kids are paying bribes to their teachers to get good marks so before they become my leaders, Boston <laughs> they, become leaders they are corrupt nah. i remember i watched a video where the child was going to give his report card to the dad and he had filled miserably <laughs> he puts money inside <laughs> the report card to give to the dad so the dad won't kill you and the dad said this is your last warning seeing the money <laughs> <laughs> so imagine this child becoming a leader i know forget right? it yeah i feel like i mean sometimes the the foundation is really important yeah. the things that we establish for generations to build upon yeah. It's absolutely important. And in, in Africa, there is a whole lot of work to be done. And we'll probably the issue of Africa. The we'll, issue we'll, of Africa we'll, we'll someday. Talk it, we'll talk it. Yeah, we'll yeah. talk about it sometime. So, another thing. Mm-hmm. With marriage and relationship, do you mm. know, I'll do a reshuffle. 
If I were a god, I'll do a reshuffle. Corrupt people, I'll make them with corrupt people. <laughs> thieves will be made with thieves. So every I'll put everybody into a trance. And then by the time you wake up, <laughs> the person who is by your side is is someone who suits you perfectly. <laughs> yeah. So nobody messes around with the other person. If you're a bad person, you are a cheat. <laughs> You, you marry a yeah, bad person a, if you're, marries a bad person. If you're a player, you marry a, a player. Good a, a good person marries a good person. person marries a good person. A virgin marries a virgin. And then yeah. <laughs> life 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 goes on. A doctor marries a doctor. In terms of career, we will we'll leave yeah. that. But so more way, like personality and character traits. Yes. Okay. If if you're a prostitute, you marry a womanizer. <laughs> I made you and you can't change. For life, you can't change. Stuck. Once you try to move towards another person, that you won't even get any attraction to another person apart from the one that I've created for you. <laughs> so I'll remove the man's rib and create a woman. That is that perfect. Perfect. <laughs> perfect. <laughs> so you're like twins. <laughs> Match for life. <laughs> and <laughs> yeah goodness yeah. wow yeah <laughs> you have some very wild thoughts that is why you are not going like oh goodness yeah wow guys like <laughs> what would you do if you were god just leave it in the comments and i think we'll leave the rest for them to discuss yes yeah yeah right so guys <laughs> thanks so much for yeah for, thanks so for, much for watching this has been one of those episodes where we leave you to also you know say what's on yeah. your mind and then we'll probably review it um at another point yes. yeah so until we meet again guys this has been a favorite podcast in the whole wide world peace out peace